I was a legacy board member, one of the founding board members of Fifth Third Bank when Brian came aboard as the CFO. So I got to know Brian when he started with the bank some 10 years ago and uh, we became good friends. We're buddies. Uh, we share secrets and uh, we share football tickets. We've worked together with Brian also at the University of South Florida. I've known Brian since he was a student at USF. Uh, he uh, actually came to work for us at TECO, so he was an employee of mine for a period of time. And then I've uh, worked with him on a lot of community activities. We've both been on the Board of Trustees at University of South Florida. Uh, we both served at the Tampa Bay Partnership, and we've become uh, really good friends along the way. Brian is family, not, not technically, but uh, Brian is a young man with an old spirit, and I like old spirits. And I came to Tampa in the year 2000, and I met Brian in about 2005. And immediately up on meeting Brian, I learned that uh, he had some things that I really liked. He had good character, he had respect, and he was trustworthy. There's no individual I've ever met that has a higher level of integrity than, than Brian does. He's always committed to doing the right things the right way. He's hardworking, he's passionate about his business, his customers, and his team and he always leads from the front, and he likes to win as a team. And that makes him just a great, great leader for us and a great leader in his market. Brian's had a terrific business career, uh, not only at our company, but he's done a great job at Fifth Third Bank. He's got huge responsibilities at the company in the state of Florida, and uh, his unit has performed very well within that corporation. He's also really been a strong contributor to our community. He's been a trustee at USF, uh, he's led the Tampa Bay Partnership. In fact, he's just transformed uh, that entire organization. He's loyal, he's honest, he cares, he's a great family man. His, his two daughters, Sinai and uh, the little one, Ava, he loves so dearly, his wife, Paulette. He's so close to his parents, to Eugene and Dolores, and he just adores them. They were his role models. So Mr. and Mrs. Lamb did an excellent job of raising that young man. We absolutely probably know this already about Brian, but he's a huge University of South Florida fan. He was a point guard on their basketball team when he was in college. Brian played basketball at USF in the early 90s, but he was captain for three years of the USF basketball team. Brian was a very successful student athlete at the University of South Florida. And he brings that same passion and competitive spirit as he did to the court to fifth, third customers and market every single day. Everyone sees Brian as being very competitive, and he is, but we spend a lot of time one-on-one. -on -one. You can see the competitiveness that sort of melts away when he among friends. Brian, this is such a wonderful recognition for you to be part of the 2016 class of the Tampa Bay Business Hall of Fame. It gives me great pride to be your friend and to welcome you into the hall. I'm proud of you. This is your moment to shine, and I want to welcome you to the Tampa Bay Business Hall of Fame. It's well deserved. Brian, welcome to the Hall of Fame. Uh, I want you to know that uh, Nida, Jennifer, Chris, myself, we're all very, very proud of you. Uh, we're proud of, uh, of all your family, you and, and Paulette, and please always know that you'll be part of our family as well. Brian, you've accomplished a tremendous amount in a short period of time. Congratulations, keep up the great work, and remember, enjoy what you've accomplished. It's been amazing, and you've earned it. Thank you.